Is Britain the destination of choice or are there other places in Europe where Romanians might want to go? Um, you are the victim of your own success, let's put it this way. Uh, after all, um, you have produced great wonders in terms of civilization. Uh, you've uh, been good at boasting about it. Uh, you have uh, an in incredible uh, pickup in terms of e economic growth. You've produced more than a million uh, jobs uh, recently. And that's, that's really what attracts people um, uh, in Britain. And, and Romanians want to go to Britain and Germany uh, typically because of the economic success this, which these two countries have, um, have shown recently. Mihal, is it mostly unskilled labour or is there a brain drain in Romania? No, there is. In, unfortunately, there's a dramatic brain drain. We've lost four million intelligent, hard-working people. I'm not talking about uh, people who, unfortunately, do not pay respect, do not uh, abide by the, by the law. I'm talking here about uh, doctors, about engineers, about IT uh, entrepreneurs, I'm talking about uh, lawyers even. So these people have left Romania and unfortunately, as a young politician who uh, happens to share the values of Margaret Thatcher, of Mr. Cameron even, um, I do see uh, the dramatic impact which this brain drain uh, has on, on, on our country. And we've got to do something about this because there's a sense of fatigue and despondency which makes people leave. We've got to create a, a new, or should I put it, framework, political framework, which would fight corruption, which would put in place the rule of law, which would open up the, the space for free markets in Romania. And that will actually keep Romanians at home. Um, and we will simply talk as friends. Uh, Britain and Romania also share important values. We fight together in a war against terrorism. Prince Charles visits Transylvania quite often. Jamie Oliver has praised the Romanian workers in, in, in London, just like Boris Johnson. And these commonalities have, have to be emphasized, okay. not just the uh, sad differences. Okay. Um, as I mentioned, you're the president of New Republic, a political party. You're hoping to be a member of the European Parliament if you get voted in. What do you hope to achieve by doing that? I do hope to... Uh, help the conservative alliance in Europe to uh, radically and dramatically restructure the European Union. We've got to change the way European Union works. We've got to give more uh, freedom and independence, independence to uh, nation states. And we've got to, to basically fight socialism and the welfare, the welfare, should I put it this way, the welfare dependency. Many people are on welfare benefits and it's good that you've done something to change that in Britain and we've got to do that all across Europe. Very interesting to talk to you, uh, Michal Nemtu of the New Republic Party. Thank, Thank you, you for bringing us your views today.